Hello, Life Vantage. This is Darren Jensen coming to you from our, uh, I'd say our broadcast studios, but from our media room here at our corporate headquarters in Salt Lake City, Utah. In, I should say, cold Salt Lake City, Utah, because all of our mountains have snow on it now. And, uh, but, uh, you know, it's like, where did fall go? We went right from summer right into winter. But uh, today is a continuation of our doctor series. And today we have Dr. Lee Seward with us. And uh, let me read you a little bit about uh, Dr. Seward. Uh, he obtained his degree in, uh, in zoology and then a doctor of veterinary medicine degrees from Colorado State University. Uh, he, he had returned to college after six years of active duty in the United States Army, including service in Vietnam as an officer and helicopter pilot where he was awarded two bronze stars. Congratulations. In 2013, Lee was named the American Heartworm Society Honorary Membership. He served on the AHS board from 1995 to 2007. Dr. Seward has created and developed products to help animals and his contributions to science have extended from uh, basic discovery through product development and beyond. And with that, I'd like to uh, welcome Dr. Stewart with us today. Welcome, glad to have you with us. Oh, thank you, Darren. It's, uh, it's an honor and privilege to, to be here with you. And I wanna say um, that being part of your doctor series is indeed humbling to me because of the tremendous guests that you've had and to be uh, included and associated with them is uh, really a privilege for me to, to join you. So well, uh, thank you for having me. You're in a unique position. Uh, you are our first veteran, uh, veterinarian that we've had on our broadcast. So, I mean, you're unique. That's great. And when we first got on before we went live, I was commenting about the poster in the back with the cows on. I'm like, it's perfect. It's, <laughs> I can tell you're a vet. Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, for those of you that are watching, as we normally do, we give away a product. We've got Pet Tandem today in right. honor of uh, Dr. Seward to be on. So we're going to give away Pet Tandem. If you'd like, if you could uh, just in the live comments, put down your, your name, your city and state, and, uh, you know, we'll, uh, uh, we'll get you into the drawing. So you can be watching this live or you can do it, you know, a day or two after. Um, typically, we wait several days before we draw. Uh, also, if you have comments, Make sure that you post those comments as well as any questions that you might have for Dr. Seward. And if, they're, if they pertain to our, you know, to our, to our discussion, I'll definitely uh, ask those. So with that, uh, Lee, how about we, uh, how about we get started? Um, one question that I always ask uh, here on the doctor series is with your, with your background in veterinarian medicine, and pharmaceutical research with animal health, with product development. Um, how and why did you become uh, associated with Life Vantage? Well, uh, it's, uh, it's an interesting question because, yeah, uh, obviously, um, well, I guess not obviously, but I, I certainly was not looking for anything when we uh, were first exposed to, to uh, Life Vantage. Um, it, uh, we got exposed um, when we were on an airplane. Hmm. Um, we were going uh, to San Antonio, Texas. Uh, my wife and I were going to a family uh, wedding and the plane was full. Um, so uh, this woman sits down next to my wife, Becky, Rebecca. And um, Becky doesn't, uh, she doesn't know any, there's no strangers for Becky. Becky has no strangers. Mm -hmm. She's uh, very extroverted and her and the lady started talking and uh, I wasn't paying a lot of attention. I was reading and we took off and within a few minutes after takeoff, the woman pulled out a, um, an iPad and started showing a video. <laughs> and as you can imagine, it was the ABC primetime investigative report. And um, I was looking over Becky's shoulder and uh, became intrigued. And I watched the video and I thought, wow, you know, pretty impressive. Uh, 
you know, a, a, a staff a faculty member from University of Colorado, Denver, uh, on the medical faculty there, uh, came up with this product. And I thought it was uh, pretty amazing. Uh, the technology, I knew something about uh, oxidative stress and free radical damage. So that started everything. Um, so happens that uh, uh, the, the people that introduced us to us, uh, the woman sitting next to Becky uh, was uh, Jennifer Bishop and her husband, uh, Stephen was sitting across the aisle. Um, and after uh, doing due diligence um, and finding out that what I saw on that video was the real deal and actually just the tip of the iceberg that I'd looked at uh, pubmed.gov found at that time, I think there was 15, 16 peer reviewed papers talking about the branded product Protandum Nerf 2, unheard of in the supplement industry to have branded product actually in peer reviewed scientific uh, journal articles. So we became distributors. And uh, I must say that uh, the bishops have been tremendous leaders, uh, mentors, and uh, actually are great friends for us. Uh, and I also like to say that, um, you know, this whole business um, is, uh, has brought us into contact with a tremendous group of people, the people with life vantage, the people, uh, the, the staff uh, at corporate and uh, our team just great people to work with. And we've really, really enjoyed that. And um, also, Darren, I would like to say also that we're really impressed with uh, where you're taking the company and uh, really appreciate all that you're doing. And by the way, you're looking pretty sharp yourself. <laughs> You've obviously lost some weight and you're looking really good. Well, thank you. I'm, I'm over 60 pounds that I've lost. So I'm uh, headed down fast and uh, thank you. Um, well, uh, thank you for giving the background on on how you came in. I, you know, it's it's interesting that I, I think there's never a bad time to talk about the company. And uh, here you had an airline flight that you were on, and somebody started talking to you, and and here you are on on our on our call today. Well, let let me ask you more uh, a scientific question now. So we have uh, 23 or so peer reviewed studies on ProTandem. You look in the the NIH. Uh, uh, database or the library uh, and pub uh, PubMed and you've I, I think there's around 180 thousand articles on oxidative stress and 9,000 on Nerf two, but most of these seem to pertain to to humans. How do we know that pet tandem would work on a dog? Yeah, um, that's a that's an interesting thing because obviously. The National Institute of Health, the NIH, and the NIH library is in fact focused on human medicine. But we have to look at it in more depth. Out of that 180,000 papers, obviously I haven't looked at all of them, but I can tell you just from looking at the literature that the vast majority of the studies on PubMed um, are in animal models. They're in animal models, or they're in in vitro, or or uh, uh, studies in cell cultures, or in other systems. Well, if they're in animal models, and in most cases, when they're in these other model systems, they're just as applicable to dogs as they are to humans. So this vast amount of literature is just as applicable to uh, to um, dogs. So we have. A demonstration throughout that literature that in animals, uh, the oxidative stress, what it's, how important it is, um, is documented in these studies. And in fact, if you look at uh, some of the publications, one of the ones I like to, to talk about is uh, uh, one that's often referred to in our, in our presentations, and you've talked about it, and it's been in the corporate presentations. Um, and that is the one that's by uh, uh, Paul and Levine out of Washington State University. Um, where the authors um, talking about NRF2 as the master regulator um, in our bodies. And their conclusion, as many of you probably remember, if you read the full conclusion or the last sentence of the conclusion, it says it is difficult to escape the suggestion from tables one and four that we may, we may be on the verge of a new literature on health effects of NRF2. 
which may well become the most extraordinary therapeutic and most extraordinary preventive breakthrough in the history of medicine. Well, if you go back and look at table one, here's what the authors comment on table one is. Most of these studies have been done in animal models. So in fact, the conclusion that, that Dr. Paul and Levine should have written is that um, may well become the most extraordinary therapeutic and most extraordinary preventive breakthrough in the history of medicine and veterinary medicine. <laughs> Good point. Because obviously their basis of their discussion is based on animal models. Not only that, if you look at the 23 papers that you referred to on PubMed that talk about ProTandem, well over half of those papers include animal models. So even in the ProTandem studies and the conclusions that are drawn through what I call translational uh, medicine, where we take and apply things that we learn in one species to other species, that those animal model studies are just as applicable to dogs as they are to humans. Case in point, um, the paper on uh, osteoarthritis. Um, in that study, Dr. Uh, Absara uh, uh, used an animal model. Mm -hmm. You know, it's based on an animal model. And further, if you um, look at the study that was on uh, from the National Institute on Aging, um, where they found a uh, uh, an improvement in longevity based on the administration of of uh, ProTandem, it is a mouse model where they found that 7% improvement in longevity um, uh, in uh, male mice. So obviously to me, um, the application from this huge database of PubMed.gov uh, applies to, to dogs just as much. And perhaps you could even make a uh, argument that it is more applicable to dogs than it is to uh, to humans. So furthermore, so, oh, keep going. Go ahead. Oh, I was going to say so. Okay, so it's applicable. Uh, I mean, you you I think you've stated very very well that and shown that okay, it has application to animal models. What uh, what makes it so unique though? What makes it unique for dogs? Or why is why is this little product so so wonderful for dogs? Yeah. Well, um, dogs, as you are well aware, um, have a lifespan shorter than ours. You know, many people say that, you know, uh, uh, one human year, um, or one year is uh, seven years in, in, in a human's life for a dog. But the, that whole ratio um, is a little bit misleading. But the bottom line is, obviously, they do age faster. Um, so they're having an increase in metabolism. That increase in metabolism means they're obviously generating more oxidative stress um, in the aging process. Furthermore, virtually all dogs are, are athletic and they are, um, in their uh, athleticism, um, they get around and are very active. Um, finally, dogs obviously are um, exposed. There, many of them are outside, so they're exposed to radiation. They're exposed to environmental toxins uh, at a rate that exceeds what we are exposed to, uh, because they're on the ground. Uh, they aren't wearing clothes. They don't have shoes on. So all the things in the the low environment that have settled there, uh, they're exposed to. Plus, we know from recent papers that much of their food is produced in a way that increases uh, uh, toxins. Uh, even from the, the commercial diets. So in that respect, if we look at um, um, what's unique about Pet Tandem in addressing that is first off, it is the only product out there that has the NRF2 activation technology, the patented technology uh, from our company. Um, it is, there's no other product out there that had that addresses oxidative stress, inflammation and fibrosis like our patented technology. Um, secondly, it, there's no other product that we all, just like we just talked about that is backed by science. Not only this vast amount of general literature that's out there, but we have studies. 
we have studies um, that were done. Uh, first one I'd like to refer to has been published in the uh, Federation of uh, American Scientists in Experimental Biology um, that was uh, actually um, authored by uh, our own Natalie Chevreau, Dr. Chevreau, um, and Dr. Barnett, among others. And in that particular study, they looked at uh, 80 dogs over a period of 60 days that were administered pet tandem. Um, and in their conclusions, what they found was that uh, dietary supplementation uh, with pet tandem resulted in significant improvements in overall owner perception of pet behavior. Owners were asked to make specific assessments, um, as well as uh, notable trends for the increase in catalase uh, and T-bars and cognitive function. Uh, these uh, results demonstrate an important wellness benefit in reducing oxidative stress in dogs. So it's been proven in that particular study that the effects of pet tandem mimic the effects of pro tandem in humans. Uh, further, uh, Dr. Chevreau also presented at a pre previous meeting of, of uh, the Federation of American Scientists in Experimental Biology, um, a study I love, and I call it the Rowdy Frisbee study. And in that study, uh, after uh, uh, throwing a Frisbee on a measured course for a, a dog named Rowdy, here's what the authors concluded. Again, Dr. Chevreau and, and Dr. Barnett were included in this. Uh, Rowdy exhibited significantly longer uh, uh, period of exercise and being, uh, after being given pet tandem for 25 days. The number of retrievals, uh, speed, distance, and time um, to variable gauge changes increased uh, over time with daily supplementation. In other words, the performance of Rowdy improved in this relatively short period of time of administration. After a short period of time of administration, uh, Rowdy was, uh, was improving. So um, obviously we have specific studies, again, with the branded product, uh, Pet Tandem for Dogs. Um, the other point I'd like to make about that, as far as being unique, is what I call the sheer genius. And that is the addition of uh, avian sternum cartilage as a source of chondroitin glucosamine uh, type two cartilage and, and uh, hyaluronic acid. Uh, avian sternum cartilage is the most bioavailable, bioavailable source, something like 10 times more bioavailable of these particular ingredients that are for joint health than any other uh, supplement available. I don't know of any other product that has this uh, that's readily available for use in, in dogs and also includes omega-3 fatty acids with all the benefits that omega-3 fatty acids have. And I think, and from watching animals and watching dogs that are given pet tandem, I think this combination of ingredients, while we don't have any data, really uh, makes the product work um, faster. I, I, not only my own observation, but a lot of other veterinarians that are uh, distributors for life vantage, um, but also other people have told me repeatedly that they are amazed at how quickly they can see the improvements in the, the well-being uh, of, their, of their dogs after administration. Uh, finally, a couple points. Uh, one is the formulation, the ease of administration. Um, it's a chewable tablet with an attractive flavor, at least attractive for dogs. Um, and the fact that it is a high quality product manufactured to human standards in appropriate manufacturing plants meeting uh, international guidelines for, for manufacturers. And it is, um, it is certified by the National Animal uh, Supplement Council, which is a group that looks specifically at product quality. So we have this high quality product um, that pro provides all these particular benefits. I, I'm just amazed, it's, it is a tremendous, tremendous product. Wonderful. Well, a question for you, and this came in from uh, uh, Darlene Power. She, she asks, uh, what age is best to start our dogs on pet tandem? Um, well, I mean, I don't think there's any reason not to start a dog uh, even as it emerges out of puppyhood. It might not get a lot of benefit in giving it to puppies, but there's no, no downside to giving it to puppies. 
but certainly I would say six months or older, um, you're, you're probably providing a benefit to that particular mm -hmm. dog. Um, we had, we, we have, um, uh, we had inherited a, uh, a puppy ourselves here a little while back, Hello. <laughs> uh, two or three years. This is Hap, Hap, um, uh, and that's my wife, Becky, in the background. Becky. Hi. Um, <clears throat> Hap, uh, we got from the, the uh, uh, pound uh, from the Humane Society of Weld County uh, when he was a puppy, and we immediately started him on Pet Tandem. Um, he's now three years old, and uh, Hap is wearing a medal that he's won. I mentioned that uh, dogs are athletes. Hap is the uh, winner of his race at the running of the wieners in <laughs> Loveland, Colorado. Hap is a, uh, is a Chihuahua, part Chihuahua and uh, part Dachshund. And uh, he's been at it, he's been on uh, Pet Tandem since, uh, since we got him. Um, we had an older dog a couple of years before we got um, Hap that passed away that was on Pet Tandem uh, in her old age. We, she was old by the time we started with Life Vantage and we immediately put her on uh, pet tandem and uh, long story short Becky and I are convinced that we got uh, probably a year of quality life out of her because she was really headed south before we put her on pet tandem and we believe that we got an extra year of quality uh, life with with our um, our, our loyal friend uh, Sheila so important product for for people that in, that enjoy and love their dogs well, I've got, and thank you. Uh, I've got a question for you. I, I'm uh, one of the most common questions or common requests that I have is, so we have, as a reminder for everyone, pet tandem. We're giving that away. So, enter your name, city, and state if you want to get into the drawing for it. But you know, this uh, the product. It says pet tandem dogs, and you've talked about how it's flavored for dogs. But uh, let's say that you're a cat person. You have a cat. Or I have run into a tremendous number of people that they give it to horses. And I don't know if they use the pet tandem. I don't know if they use pro tandem. What can you recommend for, let's say, somebody with, if I have a cat, do I give them pro tandem? Do I give them pet tandem? Uh, do I, what about horses? How do I do that? What, what's your recommendation? Yeah. yeah. Well, to, uh, to be uh, perfectly honest with you, uh, we have, uh, we're down to two horses. One time we were up to 18, but we're down to two horses. Uh, and I can tell you, both of our horses are on pro tandem, the, the human formulation. And I tell you what, uh, let me just lobby you right now. I'm looking forward to the day when we have pet tandem for horses. <laughs> okay. Uh, and I tell you, uh, I know hundreds of people that I have contact with through Life Vantage with horses, maybe thousands. Um, that are using uh, pro tandem in their horses to uh, uh, very, very good benefit. Um, our cats, we have two cats. Uh, both of them are on pet tandem for dogs. We don't tell them it's for dogs. Um, <laughs> but, uh, uh, and I know a number of people use the pro tandem. We just have found our cats, uh, uh, we can get the pet tandem for dogs by them a little bit easier than we can the pro tandem even though the protandum would be easier from a standpoint of concentration. So cats are cats. So um, getting them into the cat is a, is a challenge, but we do it. And one of our cats uh, we've had on for probably since, since we started uh, with Life Vantage is now 22 going on 23 years old. Wow. So that's quite old for a cat. And she's doing pretty dang well, too. And again, uh, she was not doing so well uh, a few years ago. So we thought we were nearing the end of her, uh, of her life, uh, quality life. And uh, uh, she's doing great. She's doing great. She's been on Pet Tandem, uh, like I said, for three or four years. So yeah. how, old, how old was your cat again? 20, going on 23 years old. I, I don't know that I've ever heard of a cat that li has lived out. <laughs> well, I think this is a pretty rare age. And we, we, we were trying to figure out how old she was the other day. And we had a uh, young man that was a neighbor uh, that when we found this cat, she was a feral cat born in our, uh, in our barn, our hay barn. Um, the rest of her, her family, 
her, her mom was not there, must have abandoned the kittens in the really cold of winter. All but two of the kittens had froze to death. So she was a survivor. Mm -hmm. And uh, of the two kittens, she's the only one now that's left. The other one passed a couple of years ago. But the kid that helped us uh, uh, socialize this kitty, uh, we just saw him the other day. He was flabbergasted that she was still around. And we counted back from the age he was when he helped us socialize uh, Pumpkin, uh, novel name, huh? Um, when we, you can guess what color she is. Um, uh, when we um, uh, socialized her, we counted back in years and it came out to 23 years. Wow, that's that's amazing. That's amazing. incredible. Yep. How do you, uh, how do you, uh, we're, we're down to our final time here a bit. How do you integrate Pet Tandem into your business? Yeah, uh, well, I'll give you a couple things that I think are, are people should be aware of because I, um, I've found it to be pretty dang effective. Uh, obviously, the first thing is, is when you're when you're building a relationship with people or when you're going through social media, uh, make your make your uh, people aware of your interest in dogs and cats and pets. Make them know that you're an animal lover. Show them pictures of your own pets, etc. That sort of thing on social media. Um, and, and if you're talking to people or if you see people walking animals, uh, pets, uh, dogs, uh, you know, uh, talk to them about your experience with, with uh, dogs and, and compliment them on their dogs and that sort of thing. But one of the couple of things that I think is pretty cool about Pet Tandem is it's reasonably priced. You know, so it's a reasonably priced product. So if you have people that may be concerned and they're not sure, uh, but they want to find out more, um, have them get their dog on pet tandem. And if they've got a dog, particularly if the dog is showing some sort of signs of aging, et cetera, or some other condition related to aging or oxidative stress, you know, they're going to see the improvements fairly quickly. And once they see it on their dog, guess what? They're going to be pretty interested in what the product can do for them. Uh, the other aspect of that, it's, it's because Pet Tandem is reasonably priced and you're so inclined, it's a great sampling product. So, you know, tell people, you know, if you, yeah, you I see your dog, uh, you know, is getting along in age and stuff and uh, not as active as he once was, here, why don't you try this? You know, and if you like it, and if it works for you, you know, you can uh, replace that bottle when you order some or whatever. But loan them some or give them some to try on their dog. I call it the gateway product for <laughs> life vintage <laughs> because it's an easy way to get people that are a little bit reluctant to get them to experience the benefit of our technology. Wonderful. Well, Dr. Seward, thank you very much. Uh, like I said, you've been our first veterinarian on, the, on uh, our broadcast. <laughs> And you did a wonderful job, and I've learned a lot about uh, Pet Tandem and, and the best uses of our products on animals. So thank you very much. Oh, you're most welcome. And again, I was so honored to be here, and, and it's just a, a great pleasure to be involved in uh, this great, great ride we're on. Well, we're honored to have great people like you as part of the company. So anyway, uh, thank you. And also thank, uh, I want to thank everybody who's joined us today. This will be uh, my only broadcast this week. I'm headed off to, uh, to, our, uh, to our Elite Academy in, I think it's in Osaka, Japan. So I'll be there for a while, then off to uh, Europe to a leadership meeting there. So um, I, I'm not sure I'll have any other time to do a broadcast uh, this week, but We'll start back uh, as soon as I'm back in the country. And so uh, from all of us here at Life Vantage, thank you. Have a wonderful week. And remember to uh, put down your name, your city, and state to get in the drive for the pet tandem. And thank you again, Dr. Seward. Oh, you're most welcome. Thank you. Bye, everyone. Bye, everybody.